Yes People What is going on. So today I'm going to show you a 10 minute workout that you can do to improve your passing, ball control and your first touch. All you're going to need is a rebound board or a wall as well as a football and you're going to be performing 10 exercises working for 30 seconds and resting for 30 seconds on each exercise. But yeah, that's enough talk from me. Let's get on with the workout. Bosh. The first exercise we're going to be performing is one touch passing with your right foot only. For this exercise and also all the exercises going forward, you want to stand around two to three meters away from either a wall or a rebound board. Throughout the 30 seconds, you want to constantly pass the ball back and forth against either the wall or rebound board. It's important when performing the exercise, you constantly adjust your body position and control your way to pass so you can perform the exercise with good technique and quality as well. The second exercise we're going to be performing is also one touch passing, although this time with your left foot only. For this exercise, you want to do exactly what you were doing for the previous exercise, although this time just with your left foot. Also ensure good technique and quality throughout the 30 seconds. The third exercise we're going to be performing is outside touches. For this exercise you want to pass the ball against the wall or rebound board using only the outside of your feet. For this exercise you also want to alternate between which foot you're playing the passes with throughout the 30 seconds. The fourth exercise we're going to be performing is going to be control and pass with a right foot only. For this exercise you want to pass the ball against the wall or rebound board and then when the ball comes back to you, you want to control it first time using only your right foot. You then want to pass the ball back against the wall or rebound board with your right foot. Continue to repeat this process throughout the 30 seconds. The fifth exercise we're going to be performing is going to be control and pass with the left foot only. For this exercise you want to do exactly what you are doing for the previous exercise, although this time just with your left foot. So taking your first touch with your left foot and passing the ball with your left foot also. Also ensure good technique and quality throughout the 30 seconds.
The sixth exercise we're going to be performing is inside touch to pass with both feet this time. For this exercise, you want to pass the ball against the wall or rebound board, and then when the ball comes back to you, you want to control it with the inside of your foot. The touch with the inside of your foot should take the ball to the opposite foot, and you should then proceed to pass the ball with the opposite foot. Look to repeat this process throughout the 30 seconds, alternating the passing between each foot. The seventh exercise we're going to be performing is outside touch to pass. This exercise is very similar to the previous exercise, however rather than taking your first touch with the inside of your foot, you want to take it with the outside of your foot. Like the previous exercise, the touch with the outside of your foot should take the ball to the opposite foot and you should then proceed to pass the ball with the opposite foot. Look to repeat this process throughout the 30 seconds, alternating and passing between each foot. The eighth exercise we're going to be performing is sole drag to pass. This exercise is very similar to the previous two exercises, however for this exercise you want to take your touch with the sole of your foot. Like the previous two exercises, the touch with the sole of your foot should take the ball to the opposite foot and you should then proceed to pass the ball with the opposite foot. Look to repeat this process throughout the 30 seconds, alternating the passing between each foot. The ninth exercise we're going to be performing is inside to outside touch and pass with a right foot only. For this exercise you want to pass the ball against the wall or rebound board and then when the ball comes back to you, you want to take a touch with the inside of your foot and then again with the outside of the same foot before passing the ball again. Look to repeat this process throughout the 30 seconds. The tenth and final exercise we're going to be performing is inside to outside touch and pass with the left foot only. For this exercise you want to do exactly what you were doing for the previous exercise, although this time just with your left foot. Also ensure good technique and quality throughout the 30 seconds.
So that's a 10 minute workout that you can do to improve your ball control, first touch, and your passing. Only 10 minutes worth of work, but lots of touches on the ball within a short period of time and within a tight space. But yeah, that's enough talk from me. Also, when doing this workout, try and use a flat surface. So if you've got a 3G or a concrete surface with a wall near you, then try and use that because yeah, I'll suffer with the pitch being a little bit bobbly. But yeah, that's enough talk from me. If you've got any questions, leave them in the comment section below. And until next time, bye.